everybody, Lawman Mike at www.lawmanguitars.com. Sorry, I got a little carried away here. I've got this really, really cool Strat, and it's one that probably a lot of you haven't seen before. This is a 1983 Fender Strat Elite. Now, what is an Elite, you might ask? Well, let me tell you a little bit about them. These were only made in 1983 and 1984, and then about 1984, they started making them in Japan. So there's a few uh, J Japanese Elites floating around out there. This one is made in the USA. Now, when these first came out, uh, Eric Clapton was uh, featured uh, on the cover of the uh, catalogs uh, playing an Elite. He really liked them, and they had one specially made for him, uh, and these were like the ones that he had. I won't tell you, like, you're getting the pro Eric Clapton one like he has, but it certainly has a lot of the same features. Uh, it's very, very different from a Strat. It has a lot of things that are Strat-like and a lot of things that are not like Strats. Uh, first thing I want to talk about is the pickups. Uh, these are single coil pickups that I have never seen before. Um, the man behind the camera, who's also a guitar player, was just asking, what are those pickups? And I said, well, they were specially designed uh, uh, for the Strat Elite uh, by Fender, and uh, they're a single coil, and they have uh, some special designs that gives them a little bit more of a humbucker sound, especially on this uh, uh, lead uh, or, a, or a bridge neck pickup. <laughs> They're also noiseless, I just noticed. Uh, they don't have put out a lot of uh, noise like a, a typical Strat pickup would uh, on the uh, full uh, front, middle, or back uh, pickups. But uh, the, the pickups sound absolutely beautiful. Uh, we'll go through the pickups here in just a little bit, but I want to tell you a little bit more about this guitar. Uh, they do have alder bodies. Uh, as you can see, it has a maple neck. Uh, it's a slab neck, so your uh, frets are, are built right into the, uh, uh, the neck itself and it has uh, really cool Fender branded Schaller tuners, uh, which are, are really a nice feature. They look totally different from uh, the, the standard Strat uh, tuners that you would see. And it has what's called a biflex truss rod. Now, uh, I haven't experienced the biflex truss rod or even tried to mess with it, but what I believe it is, is it's a dual truss rod system. Uh, so you have some flexibility in uh, managing twist in your neck as well as uh, just the, uh, um, up and down bow of, of the neck. Uh, so it also has uh, a free light vibrato. I'm just giving you the names that they uh, call these. Uh, the free light vibrato is very much different than, than the standard. Um, very, very easy to use and it has a very touchy uh, feel to it that means you can just apply just as much pressure as you want and don't have to bang on it like some of the strats we've all played in our, in our time. Uh, but anyway, uh, the other nice thing that I like about this guitar, and it's totally different, is it doesn't have a five-way switch on it. Uh, instead of a five-way switch, it has push buttons. I know, push buttons, uh, we've never seen those on strats before, uh, but they're actually quite effective. You can uh, uh, cancel them all out by having them all out. We've been playing on the uh, front pickup. The middle pickup uh, sounds a little bit out of phase, and then the back pickup... speak to you. And then the other nice thing is you can, uh, this is the, uh, uh, this is the uh, back pickup in the middle together, uh, the back and the front, uh, the, the front and middle, I mean you can do any combination you want which is very unlike a Strat which it uh, very much only has uh, the five ways that you can uh, uh, put them together. Uh, the guitar itself is beautiful, uh, it's got a, a Fender Elite uh, uh, neck uh, plate on the back. We just talked about the tuners. It's got the nice skunk stripe on the back. Uh, it's black. Uh, it does have uh, uh, very small scratches from uh, from use and uh, and pick scratches on the on the pick guard. You can't see them on the camera. Uh, you have to get them in the right light to see that. So it's really in very nice shape. There's no buckle rash at all on the back. Um, it has an access panel in the back, which uh, is smaller to uh, get to the electronics, which all lift out. Uh, but it's just an absolutely beautiful guitar. Uh, I believe I read somewhere that it has a 12 inch radius neck which uh, is actually uh, a little bit flatter uh, or actually would be a little more rounded than a, a nine and a half which you see on most strats uh, or nine and a quarter. So it just it feels really substantial is about the best way I can uh, describe it to you. And uh, Jeff the Tech set it up so it plays great.
Uh, the frets are hardly used, so uh, whoever played this guitar uh, didn't play it a lot. Uh, he played it, but he didn't play it a lot. So it's just an awesome, awesome guitar. Um, and then we also, uh, which we always strive to have at Lawman Guitars, we have the original case that comes with it. So it's got the uh, 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 chainsaw case, uh, plastic case with Fender USA on the front. It's got the nice black uh, interior. We've got some case candy in here that comes with it. Uh, it's got a Fender uh, uh, hang tag, it's got a, a fender uh, a wipe cloth, and uh, it's just absolutely beautiful. The, the case is just as nice as the guitar. So anyway, uh, it's a very unusual Strat. If you've got tons of Strats and looking for something different, this one's for you. I know a lot of people uh, look for these Elites, uh, and uh, I uh, recommend this one. It's, it's really, really nice for 1983, and, and uh, uh, like I said, it's very lightly played. So you can get this great guitar, you get the great case, you get everything that comes with it. The, uh, uh, the vibrato bar uh, is a special vibrato bar. I'm happy to say it's with the guitar. So you get everything uh, that comes with this guitar right out of the box. It's ready to go. New strings. Uh, plays and sounds great. Check this one and all the awesome guitars we've got at www. Uh, lawmanguitars.com and most especially check out our Reverb.com site where I have all my guitars. Just go to Reverb.com. They're great people from Chicago. I love them. Uh, they love me as much as they love you, the customers. So uh, they're really taking care of my customers and I really appreciate that. Uh, go to uh, Reverb.com and just type in Lawman Guitars in the search line and all my guitars will come up. I usually have around 200 guitars in there for you. I've got great guitars. So check them all out. I appreciate your time and thanks for watching today.